Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is a quick little project share. This is an embellishment box and this was made for Natasha. She is Polite Creations on Instagram and on YouTube, but on her YouTube, she did reach a thousand subscribers. She's having a giveaway. I thought, why not? And I have not made an embellishment box in so long. I actually like forgot how to make one. Like, <laughs> I'm like, what do I stick inside of? So um, I decided to use the Maggie Holmes Carousel Collection. I just used some of this heart paper that I had like on my floor from Valentine's Day. And then I use this and then I did go ahead and use my Nouveau Mica Mist. This is like gold. Of course, this thing is like clogged and I don't even know if you can fix this. I'm going to have to run it under hot water, see if it will. So I literally just had to unscrew it and kind of, you know, splash it on there to give it little like pops of gold. And then I use the 6x12 stickers. That's a sticker. I just backed it on cardstock. I use these gorgeous rosettes. These are from Lori, Creating for Fun. And I just layered them up in this like little trio. These stickers are actually from Hobby Lobby and they're very like carousel-ish. So it was perfect with this collection. This little shaker rainbow, this is from AliExpress. This crinkle stone paper is from, I bought that from Kayla. I just cut it down so it wasn't so like wide. And then this pom-pom trim is from AliExpress. It's like a pastel rainbow color, super fun. And then I just added little clusters of sequins and pom-poms throughout on the inside. I just backed it with that heart paper and then just did those with love. And then everything in here is, I mean, these little balls. Showed a little project share on how I made these guys. There's just blank ones from AliExpress and then I added some. These ones were already pre-made from Ali. These little bows are from Ali. Uh, these pom-poms are from Michaels. And then I literally just went through my charms thing and just started pulling one out of each. So there's like a bunch of different all sorts of fun charms in here. This is like a Martha Stewart paper punch uh, with the bow. These are like little tassels with a dangle bead on there. So I kind of just bent them and threw them in there. These are little, these are like charms. These ones are from Hobby Lobby, but some of them don't have the little holes on them. So the, just a bunch of little roses. Then I got these from Allie, these little donuts. These little bows I made and they've got the little wire wrapped angle and these go perfect with carousel with the black and white pinstripe and then I just did these are some pink tassels and these also are from AliExpress <laughs> so yeah that's all that you needed to make and then I did go ahead and make this little thing this is what I had in mind when I hauled these from Dollar Tree like six months ago <laughs> I finally get to use them it's the acrylic photo frame picture thing and it's got a clear coat on it once she peels this off it'll reveal like a cute little like you've reached a thousand subscribers that's just a fun little little extra for her craft room or whatnot all right i will leave natasha's information down below and her giveaway video and i will catch you guys on the next crafty video bye guys okay i did want to wrap this cute so you guys could fast forward this part you don't want to but shauna she had gifted me something that was wrapped in this like tablecloth stuff i did rip it a little bit so i'm hoping that doesn't make a difference you know what i should Ooh, let's turn this stuff up so look how yummy i'm kind of just gonna wrap it like that and i wanted to make it look kind of like a candy I think I have enough room to do so. So I'm gonna use some of this yarn from Joann's. And just tie the edge and then I'll probably tie like a tag or something on it. Super cute. And then I'm probably gonna put a, I should probably use this big giant um, piece that is always hard to use because it is so massive. So I think I'm just gonna stitch this and then put that on there. So I'll do that real quick. Like so, just quick and easy, just to give the packaging a little something. Oh, you know what I should also do is um, spell her name out in thickers. I think we're gonna do that too. Okay, so I added the thickers, spell Natasha right here. Stitch that and it just it brought it a little bit more life. I know she's just gonna rip it open, but still. Oh, some of the thickers are on here. Okay. Yeah, that is my entry. And I will catch you guys on the next crafty video. Bye guys.